Hello! Well, it has been that long since I've actually played this game. Um, so hopefully some of you guys are still viewing it, but uh, yeah, basically I'm back and uh, it has been a long time so I apologize for that, but we're going to continue for where we left off if I can actually remember what's going on. Oh dear. That's why I prefer tea. I assume that we got very, very drunk this isn't the in the last video. Inn. Hello, skeleton. This would make a great candle holder. <laughs> Why not? Why not just pick He's up a bit of a skeleton? Because that's normal. Ooh, a conch. What a fine conch. Maybe oh. I should have knocked first? I'm up. not going near the house of Pinch until that crab leaves. He has an issue with crabs. No superfluous collectibles in the barrel. Ahoy there, Skinny. Is that a piece of eight in your pocket? Mind if I borrow it? I'm a little short. This guy is looting corpses. Cheers. Ahoy there, Slim. Which came first, the ship or the bottle? Which came first, the ship or the bottle? Being the massive geek I am, I've always wondered how they managed to get the ship in the bottle. Like, do they make the ships and then build the bottle around it, or...? These things are everywhere! Am I just being stupid? I don't know. It certainly would change the dynamic of the game if that gun were in working order. Nothing in there, I'm afraid. Seems useful. But this bucket is rusty <coughs> through. Hmm. Well, I've pretty much clicked on everything. So we're probably gonna have to go to the jungle now. Hmm. I got jungle fever. I shouldn't venture into an unknown jungle without good reason. Well, because I told you to? I shouldn't venture into an unknown jungle without good reason. Oh, can you go down the beach? Click on this mound. There appears to be something buried in the sand. Well, hey. That's more like it. Some money. Nothing more in the box. Okay, so. Do we look at the broken no barrel? No superfluous collectibles in the barrel. I'm not going near the house of Pinch until that crab leaves. Okay, so. We'll not be needing that. Why won't we go in the jungle? I shouldn't venture into an unknown jungle without good reason. Hmm. Okay, let's look at the sign. Welcome to Cannibal Island. Trespassers will be eaten. Oh, how pleasant. What's this I was lying on? Dear sure cannibals, that before. we be wanting to come ashore for a bit of exploring and recreational digging. Please be accepting this token as a sign of good faith. Kind regards, Captain Howell. Howell! There's something written on the other side. Ahoy there, Jolly. If ye be reading this, ye ain't dead. Arr. Good for ye. He really wrote, <laughs> Arr. Kindly be asking the natives if they be minding us coming ashore for a few days to be searching for the unusual treasure this island be offering. Captain Howell. P.S. Here be some of them crackers ye like. Sure, because why Howell. Not? I'll help you. When pigs fly. Well, I'm here now. If this island does have a treasure, I could find it and keep it for myself. Assuming I could get off here somehow. True. Now we go to the jungle. Let's see what this island has to offer. Hey. Oh, hello there, Piggly Wiggly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still not helping how. Owned. Or a pig. <clears throat> yeah, I, I, 
I love this game just because it's so tongue in cheek and takes the piss out of itself a bit. And I like that. I like that about games. You seen what stuff we have, like you know, inventory, what we left off with last time? Because I don't know. The main design. flaw in this design is most pirates can't read. That is true. Although how how do they write letters and stuff? These trees are more flexible than I gave them credit for. Let's look at the barrel. This barrel is keeping this mango and these crackers off the ground. Well, yes. These crackers don't look half bad. This is just begging to be taken. I've taken everything else. What's one more thing? Okay, we have a barrel with a hole in it. Let's check the rest of the jungle. I don't like the look of those leaves. No, I don't either. And there's a bottle of rum hanging. So... I don't want to get any closer to that trap until I know what it does. I don't want to get any closer to that trap until I know what it does. Uh Okay. Can, can we throw something? I can't use this small barrel there. Uh... Come get the nice mango, piggy! Why doesn't he want He's the mango? He's too interested in that other mango. Okay, so... How do we get rid of that? I don't want to get any closer to that trap until I know what it does. So how can we get rid of that other mango? How do we make our mango more special? I don't want to get any closer to that trap until I know what it does. Okay, I get you. Here, pig, pig, pig. Well, is there something else I can lure him with? Skull. Is I don't know why I'd use Scully there. Just, just for the crack. Why not? Our part helps out. Hello, Juan. Oh, hi there, matey. I'm stuck. I'm having trouble. Luring, Luring that pig. pig. Do you not be wanting to scare the beast? Yeah, I know. Do you that. have any more information? Crack air! Crack air! Okay, here you go. What? Down the hatch! I be thinking those voodoo spells might work in reverse. Try the voodoo stuff in the scare beast. Spell backwards. Mind and check your book. And use the voodoo cheat sheet on yourself. And use a mango on the pig when you're glowing. Okay. Right. Okay. That's all for now. Better the hatchlings. Okay, so... Let's look at the cheat sheet. Oh, I, I don't know how to... Uh, how, do you, how do we quit? No, we don't want this anymore. Voodoo for pirates. Let's read it. Voodoo stuff. Raise the dead. Scare beasts. I'm going to have to write this down, I think, because I have a very bad memory. So we have dodgy diamond with a cross through it, and we're doing this backwards, aren't we? So we do that last. So we do the circle before that, we do the the lol, and start with that square thing. Or that rectangle, I mean. Um, 
Do the voodoo stuff, shoot the food, the animal, the results should be instant. 